Would you use your own house as a bathroom? The UN, Bill Nye, Neil deGrasse Tyson, and the science community all agree that we are using our house as a bathroom, or the Earth, and it's not beneficial. An example of one of these human habits is factory farming. A cow on overage releases between 70 and 120 kilograms of methane per year. They do this through flatulence. Methane is a greenhouse gas like carbon dioxide, but the negative effects on the climate of methane is 23 times higher than that of the effect of CO2. Therefore, the release of about 100 kilograms of methane per year for each cow is the equivalent to about 2,300 kilograms of CO2 per year. Let's compare this value of 2,300 kilograms of CO2 you can get the same amount of carbon dioxide generated by burning a thousand liters of petrol. So with a car using eight liters of petrol per hundred kilometers, you could drive 12,500 kilometers per year or 7,800 miles per year, excuse me. There are one billion cars in the US and the same amount of cows and bulls, so the effect of livestock is clear, especially not factoring in all the other types of livestock contributing methane. In the United States alone, there are over 260 million acres of forests that have been cleared to make room for crop fields, most of which are used exclusively to grow livestock feed. This is not a practice that only occurs in the US. Land clearing in Brazil to grow chicken feed is responsible for the destruction of 3 million acres of rainforest. And these numbers are only account for the land cleared to feed animals. Cutting down the filter of our air makes the effect of factory farming doubly on the environment. So, all this matters, but if not for the animal's sake, then do it out of compassion and heart. More people will suffer and die from flooding and droughts if things remain the same. Please try and put yourself in the shoes of our children, which will have to suffer and work tooth and nail to fix the problems we put on them. So let's lighten their load by reducing the amount of meat we eat, by buying more fuel-efficient cars, and protecting our forests. An unwavering commitment to others gives life meaning and purpose. Thank you.